everyone, you are watching Mickey's Toy Box and today we are unboxing the Bunny Barn's very own rat box. Joining us today is... Noaz. Deuce. Kai Oh, Tresco Alpho and Gigi. So this is total new territory for them that haven't been in this room before. Okay, so let's open the box. It looks quite different than the bunny box. It is smaller and it opens up this way. And let's see what do we have. Okay. First up we have, ooh, a nice big hammock. It's double-sided. One side is this nice lilac -y purple. And the other side is this bluish green. Then we have a corner or triangle hammock. Then I see this container and it contains these pallets. They are not showing interest in the sound, so let's see maybe the smell. You want some? It smells good. Take one. Yeah, you always take, right? But you don't want to eat it now. Huh? Take one. They'll probably eat it when they're settled in their cages. Then we have a wooden chew toy that you can clip on into your cage, which is pretty easy to clip on. That's always a bonus because I struggle with the other clips on the bread toys. what's this oh this is a voucher this is a 10% off bridges product voucher and I can order through whatsapp what are you guys doing just put it there don't eat that please and then there's another one then we have ooh, what's this Oh, okay, okay. But it says do not eat. Who's climbing on me? These are seed bombs and they are designed for easy gardening. Apparently you just pop them in the ground and throw some water on them and I can see some sunflower seeds. I'm not sure what the other ones are. But these you shouldn't be eating, okay. Then what's this? Oh, cute! Let me just show you these, because I didn't really show you them. Let's put it on top there so they don't eat it. Okay, so this is the next item. And it's a pen, I believe. Oh, it's a nice pen. And it's a carrot. It's super cute. Oh, someone's eating. Then we have a bowl. And one of these bowls. These are cool. I like these. I used to have them for most of my animals. Are you enjoying the tube toy? 
yeah, he should be enjoying chew toys because he chewed off their wooden doll keeping their little basket on and they all went tumbling down. Luckily the cage is not very high. It didn't get hurt. What is this? It's like a business card, okay. There's the little business card if you want to support. This is the rat box from the bunny barn. They are the same people that did the bunny box that I opened with Smokey. And it is built for two rats, I think. But I own a lot more than two rats. I'm going to add these toys to my ever-growing toy collection and they will enjoy having their toys rotated. My rats seem to enjoy the palettes. I don't know what brand of palettes this is. I assume this might be a Burgess brand. The wooden chew blocks uh, seem to be Noaz's favorite. He already chewed off a nice big chunk of it. Now let's see. Uh, they seem to okay. They seem to enjoy the food and the chew blocks. So there has been some interest in the ball. They won't show any interest in the hammocks now since it's not hanging in the cage. They will definitely use it and chew it up. I stopped using hammocks about a year ago, mainly because it is a lot of work with the amount of rats I have. So I have replaced hammocks with baskets, which I can just wash by hand or in the dishwasher. This little ball is adorable. I love it and it will be useful as balls always are. And I love the pen. I'm an avid gardener so these are going to be useful as well. I am just not sure which seeds are going to come up from these. Maybe I should plant them in seeds. If you own rats or bunnies or guinea pigs, contact the bunny barn and get yourself one of these subscription boxes. If you want to know what's in the previous boxes, the two bunny boxes I've got, you can check in the iCard or in the description below. Make sure to check out the links for the Bunny Barn and the Bunville Rabbit Rescue because all the funds raised with these boxes go to help rescued bunnies. If you love rats or you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. I know I haven't been very active lately, I've been moving. So there will be a lot of new videos since my craft room has doubled in size and this is one corner of it that is now a nice recording spot. I'll be adding some more cushions and getting a better throw. This is just one I'm using now to protect the couch from rat pee since they are boys and they tend to mark.
Hey. What you doing? 